going on YouTube welcome back to my channel and today I'm not really prepared honestly but we do got some brand new kicks in um, obviously if you guys can see red red tape so if you guys have ordered from this place you should know Y'all should know what is in this box. This shoe right here has been has upwards is gone upwards to like man, I'd say up to like almost two thousand dollars of once this shoe went up towards around almost two thousand dollars. Like can y'all believe this? And on top of that I got this shoe for a god dang steal. Like for real this shoe for a for a steal you know what i mean gotta have some hands and ties on dick but anyways yeah i got this shoe for like a steal and this shoe like i said it, it's gone up towards almost three almost two twenty five hundred to two thousand dollars let's say like it's crazy how the hype dies instantly which is freaking insane Ooh, these are my first time looking at them. Oh, that's kind of crazy how these don't come with the, these don't come with the, the little shoe lining inside it. But anyways, yeah, these are the 1.0s in the maroon colorway. My God, finally have these in my possession, now in my collection. Ooh, God dang. And these are, I can't really believe these shoes went up towards almost $2,000. Like, that's fucking insane. Like, can you believe this shoe right here almost cost $2,000? Like, that's insane. Like, like let me know. I, obviously, I already know the answer. Like, who would pay this much money for this shoe? You know, even just a shoe in general, you know? Like, that's just insane, bro. Because I finally got them in my possession. And you guys won't believe I got these for literally a hundred a hundred dollars man that's just insane a hundred dollars for these shoes right here bro that's crazy now to compare it so obviously this is the og this is an og right here the og ultra boost 1.0 pattern um so now i have i have them right here on my table i have the whole collection now pretty much so obviously you got your 1.0s you know and now you got your Obviously, you got your 2.0s, which is the only 2.0 I have in my collection, but I'm fine with it because this shoe is fire. It is the multicolor. Whew. The multicolor. This is the only... This is the only shoe I did cop for retail. No. I cop my other ones for retail. I copped a couple of the Ultra Boots for retail, but most mainly all my Ultra Boots have been on sale. So, yeah. 2.0 right here. And then you got your 3.0 right here, which is one of my favorites just for your toes. Like the 3.0s for your toes are fucking comfy, man. I, I love these. And obviously these mean a lot to me, 3.0s. So these mean, these have um, sentimental value to me. So these are special, 3.0s are special. And now you got your like your quote unquote 4.0. Um, it has, still has that 1.0 pattern. It's gonna be really hard to see because it's a black shoe. But these have like the 1.0 pattern. And um, yeah, they call these the 4.0s. Um, and now I have the, the only one I have in my collection, which is my work shoe, is my uh, the Ultra Boost 19. I do have a pair of the Ultra Boost 19. Um, really comfortable shoe. But yeah, this is more like an active type of shoe. Um, like obviously it's meant to be for running. But yeah, these are definitely for like a, you know, like fitness or just running, walking, whatever. These Ultra Boost are like pretty much, you know, you could go out to the grocery store without no problem, you know, go out or something. These are still fire, in my opinion. Ultra Boost are still, still the shoes to cop, honestly. Like, especially for under retail, under retail, psh, you can't go wrong with them, man. And then obviously I have the, they have some 1.0s as well. These are what I like to call my PEs. In the Lakers edition, whoo, fire, bro. We got that 1.0 pattern as well. Um, and yeah, I mean, fire shoe. But yeah, the only other um, maroon colorway I have is the Ultra Boost Mid 
um, ATRs, I think they were called. Uh, the ATRs. These are actually, these are like my workout shoes for the winter. Just because it gets, uh, where I live at, it gets really cold. Um, so yeah, these are my workout shoes for the winter. Um, but yeah, this is like the only, you can see kind of the differences. Um, they are, in my eyes, they have, this one is a little bit more red. This one's more of a darker red. But like on camera, I don't know if you guys can see it on camera, but yeah. On camera, it looks like the, yeah, yeah this one's a little more brighter. And then, yeah, this one's a little bit more reddish, I'd say. But, yeah, these are fire. These are fire, bruh. I still can't believe I got these for retail, under retail for 100 bucks, bruh. That's just insane. And I always I, I wanted to get the, the wool gray ones because they had those in GS sizes as well. But I already have a gray Ultra Boost, so it's really doesn't... I'm just like, why do I need another great shoe? Even though I, you know, I can go with anything. But I just cop the, cop the red one. And honestly, I'm not mad because these are actually, I actually like these too. So, but yeah. So that is pretty much it for this quick video. Probably have some on feet for you guys. Um, but yeah, these are, you really can't believe it. That's pretty much the whole video right there, man. Ultra Boost under retail. So can't complain man Whew. if you guys are still yet to not try ultra boost you guys are missing out ultra boost is the best thing you could ever wear for your feet like straight up you know like still like if, if you guys are like sneakerheads and you guys have yet not to try ultra boost you guys are really missing out man these are ultra boost are my favorites that's why i have a plethora of them like they're that comfortable so that is just pretty much it. Another fire ultra boost in my collection. Like ultra boosts are just a wave, man. They're still to me. They're still hype. I, I still like my ultra boost. But let me know down in the comments. Uh, what do y'all think? Did you guys cop uh, the, any one of the retros? You got the you got the um, burgundies, the maroons. You got the wool grays. Then you got the triple black. I really wanted to get the triple black. I really wanted to, but I really would want to get something that pops. You know, I want something that pops. You know, so that's why I was like, yeah, I just stick with the maroons. And like I said, I'm happy. I actually look. I like these in person too. So yeah, let me do. Let me know down in the comment below what y'all think about uh, these 1.0 maroons. Y'all dig them? And in general about older boots have you guys tried these have you guys nah and if not like why not you know like let me know but with all that being said <laughs> that's gonna be it for me so youtube i definitely will see you guys in the next video so much money coming and i watch me play